Hey guys, today I just want to talk about some tips that might make it a little more user friendly to get your wives, your daughters, your moms, um, and so forth involved in this sport and make it more enjoyable for them. So what we have right here, this is Long Range Lexi's Voodoo, uh, her precision rimfire. And if any of you have been paying attention, you might notice it looks different. Uh, why does it look different? This here is what the chassis that she's normally running. This is an MPA BA comp. We absolutely love these chassis. I have like six or seven of them. But with the Voodoos and the Rimfire specifically, um, these chassis tend to be a little heavier in the back which on a shorter barrel with the rim fire, it makes it harder to balance. So you can see here, we have the full internal weights. We have a set of gray ops weights. Then we have some custom heart weights on there just to get this thing to balance. And I actually have already switched it out, but there's a heavy spigot mount that I normally run in this configuration too. And it helps to make the rifle balance, but it's incredibly heavy. When this thing's all loaded up, we're pushing 19.6, 19.8, somewhere in there. So for Lex, she's a small statured woman and that's asking a lot. You know, we come in and out of barricades and it's easy for me to grab my bag with one hand and manipulate the rifle with another, but that's a little tougher for her. So what I've done is I've put this in this chassis here, this is my hybrid. This is actually from my NRL Hunter gun, but we're just trying some things out, trying to give her a little better advantage when we go to nationals. So in this configuration, I still have internal weights um, and I have the heavy spigot mount up front, but we have a much better balance point on the rifle. And all together, this rifle was shaved about four and a half to five pounds off of it. We're still tweaking a few things um, as we play around with it. So just a thing to consider that these rifles are heavy and obviously that heavy helps uh, settle the rifle down um, and it makes it easier to shoot off of barricades and such. But if it's difficult to maneuver in and out of barricades, then you're kind of shooting yourself in the foot, so to speak. Please don't shoot yourself in the feet. So just a thought, this is a good option if you're looking for a nice way to balance the rifle. Again, this is the MPA hybrid. And with the Voodoo, this is a 18 inch Kukuri barrel. So it's not even really their heavy barrel. And with a little bit of extra weight out front, it balances really well. This is a custom spigot mount, but MPA now makes a steel mount. Um, that will help in that manner too. So uh, what we'll probably do is get another one of these coming and then we'll get it dolled up uh, in Lexi's style. But for the meantime, to get ready for nationals, we're just trying this configuration. We went out today and did some practice. She definitely felt more comfortable with it. So just a good option, something to consider. Um, your small, sat, small statured adults um, this is a lot more enjoyable a lot easier to maneuver in and out of barricades around props and so on and so forth and if it's easier to do uh, then it usually translates to more fun so if you need any help getting your wives and daughters and moms and aunts and cousins involved in this sport uh, ask me how i can help I'd love to do everything I can. We have loaner rifles. There's a loaner rifle back there. It's a great rifle for a beginner. It's super lightweight. So that's today's topic. I hope I see you on the range, guys.